Hey guys, it's me, Zed, and welcome back to another Dinosaur Simulator video. Today I'm going to be playing as the Galactic Terror, Mr. Ringman, whatever you can call him, Shotgun Blast Man, I don't know. But basically, this is the closest thing we have to V3, and I really like V3 because of its roars and just everything. It, like, this is my favorite skin right now. Like, mm, I don't know if it's in general, but I definitely know it is for the Albino Terror because Wraith Terror was going to take that place until he got his remodel. Because I hate Brave Terror's remount, like remodel. I don't know why. I just really do not like it. I think like if it would have walked on its legs, maybe I would have liked it a little bit more. But I am it just they kind of changed it a little bit too much. They it doesn't really resemble a tear anymore. Kind of re like represents like something from like a Subnautica or something. Like one of those warper things. I'm not sure though. It just reminds me of that for some reason. I think it's because of like the tentacles on the back. But this right now, I'm pretty sure, is for 40,000 DNA. If you have 40,000 DNA, you have Albino Terror. If you haven't seen this yet, you can buy this. It is really good for combat, like what I've been saying. Well, it's not really good for combat. It's one of the best Terror skins for combat, I'm pretty sure. I'm not really good. I'm not, like, heavy topic on uh, combat, so I wouldn't be taking my word for granted. I'm only, like, heavy word on things that I know. Heavy word on, like, the news that is going on with this game. Like, new skins, new everything because that's just like how I roll. I'm not really like that heavy on the combat thing. If it works, it works. And if it doesn't, then I die most most of the time. But I've just been kind of chilling out with these guys on PC. I met a couple of fans yesterday. Thank you guys for coming out and hanging out with me. It was really cool if you're watching the video right now. It was really cool playing with you guys. And we should do it again. If you guys want to play with me, then you're gonna have to like message me in the comments or if you have an Xbox message me at Zeden same as my YouTube channel so if you want to look me up you can do that actually right now I'm a communication band so I will be um, if you do message me I'll look your name up and if you get messaged by an alt account like goes by a name of Meadow or something I will be messaging you back because for some reason I got comm banned. I do not know why, because they did not tell me why I got comm banned. And that's beside the point. Anyways guys, this video is specifically around Galactic Terror on just how it's just basically, it's basically a level 40 Indominus Rex from Jurassic World. And oh, there's some terrors too. Yin and Yang over here. I really do not like this remodel for the Albino Terror. It just looks like kind of like chalk, like Sesame Street went ham on it. And that's, that's what the, that's what came out. Not really albino anymore, more like gray, but I don't know. I don't, I'm not here to hate on the terror. I just really like Galactic Terror a lot more than this terror because then again, it reminds me of V3. It has better roars, in, in my opinion. And that's just what I think. But, anyways, guys, off that subject, if you did not know, we are getting possibly. If he has enough time, we're getting possibly a insectoid remodel or a stalker allosaurus remodel. I think there was something else that was he like that he was gonna do. I think it was no, it was the AV skin he's working on. Because the AV skin is coming along very nicely. If you are you, like if you're in my Discord or the Unhash um, Games Discord, if you want to join mine, link in the description down below. But if you're in either of those, you would see it already in DS teasers or just teasers. It looks really good, and I can't wait to play as it. I'm pretty sure the DNA count is, like, solid. Like, the price is 35000 like, if you want to buy it. Like, that's that's what it's going to be, so... I'm pretty sure that's the confirmed amount that it's going to be. I'm not really, sh like, 100% on it, but that's what everyone's going with. So, if you want it get up to 35,000 as soon as possible because I'm pretty sure it might be going limited. We're n I'm not really sure what it's called yet. I think there is a name somewhere, but I'll have to go ahead and like search around for it, look and see what it's going to be called because last time I remembered it was Scythe something. There's a lot of people around me. Hello. It's America. I might make a video on that actually. I, I could. It would be, it wouldn't be like a like really good video. It'd just be like kind of a short little video. Like if you want to see that on like Fourth of July, then go ahead and just leave a like on this video. 
Hello, Terrain the Titan. You can come over here and we're not gonna kill you. I mean, you can't hear me, but, like, if you're watching the video, then you should have just came over here and, like, hung out with us. I love that IO animation for the Albina Terror. It's such a neat thing that they did for it. It's just, like, I don't know. Like, it's kind of weird. I don't think the pitch does it, actually. I think the pitch only twitches and stuff, which I think that wasn't a really good, like, decision made for it because I think it should have really done what the cell by terror did but like I remember when the pitch black terror was going to be coming out with uh, like the orange stuff on it which is basically the um which is basically gonna, like going to be the indoraptor of the game which well technically it kind of is it's pitch black terror albino terror but like I don't know like, if they would have made it, like, a little bit different or something, that would have been cool, but, I mean, I like it the way it is. The Pitch Black Terror, the Albino Terror, I, I do not like, but that's my, that's not my decision. They did a good job on it, that's all that matters. There's a lot of footprints everywhere, jeez. Hey, it's a futile. They completely forgot about this dino. Come here. I can't pick him up. Okay, then. Um, you don't really see people climbing a lot, do you? This guy could climb and, like, get away from, like, people if, like, he really needed to. Hello. Hey, you finally came over. Hey, no, come. No, okay. You can just run over there. Alright, then. I think that fantasy Quetzal was actually trying to kill this thing, like, earlier. Now that he's, like, getting surrounded by a bunch of terrors, then now he's not. Because he can get easily killed by us. And picked up, I'm pretty sure. I'm not sure, though. Because they changed all the pickup things, and now he can't pick up like some sort like some sort of things like i've always had trouble with picking up flyers and stuff like like the wyvern i haven't been able to pick up lately i'm not sure if like it's designed like that but i mean if it is then i respect that good touche for you what is that on the island is that a sore fagonex what what are you Oh, you are a sore fagnex. Hello. Alright, then. <laughs> Hit this slow zoom in. <laughs> I have finally changed seasons. Oh, there is something up there. Oh, it's a navy. Okay, well. I mean, we're gonna end it off there. But anyways, guys, if you like this video, make sure to like, subscribe, comment down below, and tell me what you want for the next episodes. Make sure to join our Discord down below for more teasers and just the chat in general. I'll be telling you whenever I'm gonna be recording a video. That's it for always. I'll see you guys later.